Hello, Scorpio, and welcome to your monthly reading. If this resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Scorpio, please do check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Scorpio out there. Cross watchers, please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa, interchangeable. So however it resonates with you, this is for Scorpio. This is for Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to know? What does Scorpio need to know? This is for Scorpio. Let's see. Okay. Ooh, look at that. So, very nice. All right. So, here's what's going on. You got an apology headed your way and you've got a big decision to make. And this person is messing with your mind pretty hard. So, is it over or is it not? They... <laughs> they you're ignoring them that's for sure so uh, they're they're going to break the silence in a pretty pretty big way and there's going to be an apology i feel like these uh there was attempts at communication that kind of fell flat for you you could be dealing with a fire sign or somebody with fire in their chart i will um before we get too deep here in the love reading i will read the career reading after the love reading for those of you that are interested and i will pull a little advice card a little message from the universe a little affirmation for you here scorpio so all right so king of wands energy we've got fire energy like i was saying male or female but this person frustrates you to pieces that's what I want to say with this. They they get pretty heated sometimes, but the passion is very strong between the two of you. Um, you may or may not want this person back into your space um, because it's like, what do I do here? And you just decided, ah, I'm done. And they, as soon as you do that, then they come back around with, you know, some a, a bigger more substantial apology um so that energetic disconnect is definitely felt here they come uh, a lot of communication headed your way and i feel like these the first attempts did not go anywhere they did not go anywhere they fell flat so um determined to speak with you and um, some major offers falling in your lap from this person. Huge apologies. And it's like they're pulling out all of, of the stops here. So this is their last ditch effort to get you to pay attention to them. Because they still have hope here. You, what do you want? What is your wish? You could be dealing with an Aquarius or somebody with Aquarius in their chart it is the moment now it's like they they feel you slip it completely you know slip it away you're kind of cold towards them and i feel like it's like this this build bubbling up inside of this person like and then they just can't take it anymore and then uh you know these these little tactics that they have aren't working anymore it's not getting getting them anywhere so they got to be bigger and louder and stop and say hey scorpio you know it's going to be something you know that movie <laughs> say anything with john cusack and he's got that boom box over his head they're they're going to act like it's going to be something like that like yeah 
So we got the star card here. They still have hope, but do you? What is your wish fulfillment? What do you want? Can the situation be healed? So they're willing to, I want to say, make a fool out of themselves here. But you are freeing yourself of this situation. A lot of you could be going through a divorce or a legal separation. And they do not want this separation. They do not want this separation. So they're willing to do whatever. Okay. All right. So... Here we have the Two of Swords covered by the World card. Is it done? Is it over? For you it is. For them it is not. For them it is not. They still feel like there's a chance here to continue the cycle. Huge decision for you. Some of you may want this. But it's up to you at the end of the day if you want it or not. If you still want them. I mean, plain and simple. What do you want, Scorpio? So these attempts at communication, these, hey, I miss you, blah, 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 if they even get through, they're, they're you know, how you been? I left something over at your house. It's just these tactics that they have, they're not working because you're ignoring them. Page of Pentacles, it, it's these lame attempts Lame attempts turn into bold attempts. All right, so we got the three of pentacles here. You're ignoring them. Your future forward. You've made your decision. They are, they're not happy with your decisions that you're making here. So here comes the apology. Knight of Cups here. Very heartfelt. It's bigger. It's, you know... They're, they're saying what they saying what they need to say. Knight of Cups here. So here it comes. And you're just, you're all out of words. You're all out of love. Right? I'm all out of love. And they're so lost without you. <laughs> Who sings that? Why are all these songs popping in my head? Eight of Cups here. So, yeah. You're, you're on a little bit of a journey, a solo journey here. You want what you want, what you want, and you're being stubborn about it. Mm -hmm. So you got your arms folded here. And I feel like, you know, this person may have even attempted some late night drunken text messages that did not go over well with you. That's probably for three of you out there. But eight, eight, or sorry, nine of cups here. You want what you want, what you want. You want your wish fulfillment. You want your happiness. That's what you want. And if it's not with this person, then you are on your way to find someone else. You're over it. This person is very frustrating to you. I feel like an offer is going to fall in your lap here, you see? So it's bold, this offer, it's something tangible you can hold on to in, in your hand. They need to settle the energy down, they need to get serious, and they, they need to show you how much they want you. And that's exactly what they're getting ready to do. Queen of Pentacles energy here. You're going to have to think about this. This thing that falls into your lap from this person. Earth energy. Be dealing with an earth sign, male or female, if I didn't say that before. So, has too much happened? Are these cups of yours, can this person ever fulfill them again? So here they are. That's their attempt. Here's your setting again. Set very stubborn about the situation. Do you see that? Arms folded, arms folded. You're like, mm mm, mm mm. Nope. No, no. Huge decision. It's a major decision. Libra energy here. Can there be balance? Are there, is there lessons learned? Is, is this a karmic situation that's coming to a close? 
Are you over it? Do you want it? It's, a, it's up to you. It is up to you, Scorpio. But a significant, a significant apology coming from this person. Please clarify the Justice card for Scorpio. Please clarify the Justice card for Scorpio. Whoo, here they come. They got a lot to say. They've got a lot to say. Could be more of a face-to-face -face situation, traveling, fast-moving energy, Knight of Swords. Lovers here, Gemini energy. What are you going to do? Are you going to follow your head, your heart? Where's your heart at when it comes to this person? Are you still open to receive them? Or are you completely closed? Are you completely closed? I think a lot of you are completely closed here. So. That's what's going on. Oh, I want to read the uh, financial read. That's what's going on there. So a significant and quite meaningful apology headed your way because they can't let it go. And the, the quieter you are, the more frustrated and, and crazier they get. So they know they gotta bring they gotta bring it. This is this is it. This is the final decision. All right, so. In regards to career, Scorpio, I feel like you are making a, a, a huge decision between um, two different situations. Either, either, I feel like you got in the state of mind like, okay, I need something more here. I need something more. So you started, you started looking around looking towards the future and you started you know seeing what else was out there okay so now now you got a situation where the old the old job still wants you and the new job here comes you know some good money news from a new situation okay so what are you going to do? You're going to continue the cycle where you're at? Because I feel like what's going to happen is, you know, you're going to say, hey, like say you go to your boss or your manager or whatever, and you say, hey, I got this new opportunity and I th I'm thinking about taking it. Well, they're going to say, mm, not so fast, Scorpio, because we got it like a counter offer. That's what I want to say. So you're going to have to make a decision on if you want to close one door and open up another. Like I said, you you were like mm, searching around. You really weren't getting fulfilled where you've been. You want something bigger and better for your future. And I feel like your, your past job was just kind of putting you felt put on pause doing the same thing no room for advancements or, or raises or anything like that but once you get word <laughs> once you get this communication in about a new opportunity that you know you're you're thinking about taking a chance on it's it's like then they'll step step into action before they lose you all right so yeah and I don't think you're going to expect that of them. But, you know, you got an, an offer. An unexpected offer and an offer. And you got this, you got this big old coin here laying right in your lap. And you're going to have to decide on what you want to do. Who, who's, who's got the better deal? Who's got the better deal, Scorpio? Because one, one situation is better than the other. Are you bored where you're at? Right? Where, where, is your, where, where is your wish fulfillment? Where is your heart going to sing? You know, where, where's the money at? Where's the stability at? Where's some happiness at? Huge decision for you, but you're, you're the one, again, that's going to have to make that 
based upon your situation. But it is huge. It's a huge decision. Follow your head. Follow your heart. What do you do? But you will make the decision that is best for you in your current situation. So like I said, yeah, you were feeling some type of way at work. You started looking around and all of a sudden, you know, you, you got an offer coming in and it's a good one. And it's like now everybody wants you. And so there's... A counter offer where you're at so do you stay do you go it's kind of, you know let's pull you an advice card here Scorpio and see what the universe wants to say what your affirmation is this is for Scorpio what does Scorpio need to know what does Scorpio need to know we have discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to do. Very stubborn. Remember, we were talking about that stubborn energy. You want what you want what you want. You got somebody with their arms folded here and their arms folded here. You can't give me the happiness that I want. I will go somewhere else. If you can't give me the the money, the job, the advancement that I want, I will go somewhere else. So, you can do what, whatever you set your mind to do, it's yours. So, there you go, Scorpio. That's what's going on. I hope that resonates with some of you, most of you, all of you. You can now follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Rumble. I'll leave those links down below in the description box. Scorpio, you have a beautiful day and a great week, and I will talk to you soon. Take care, and God bless.